I got to see the sun rise over the Grand Canyon from in the canyon. I mean, the, the human vocabulary is just not even uh, sufficient to describe what it looks like down there. And to uh, go down into the inner canyon, as you go closer to the river, where there's a creek running through there and waterfalls, and uh, it's just uh, unimaginable, and I always wanted to do that. Part of my quest for fitness was to open the doors to things that I could never do before that were unimaginable and now are all possible. I'm just a regular guy. I'm just a regular guy who's 51 years old who woke up one morning and said, I'm not going to do this anymore. This is not the life I want to have. It's not the life I deserve to have. And my children deserve to have me around for a long time as a happy, healthy, energetic guy. And I wasn't that, and I am today. And it's because of Dr. Frank and his team that I've been able to do that. I've lost 71 pounds. Dr. Frank gave me um, what I needed, which was a sensible diet and that you can actually stick to. It makes sense. Um, safe supplementation and a support system. And that's really what you need to be to be successful in a uh, fitness plan, is you've got to have a sensible diet, not some fad diet or some crazy thing that's impossible to stick with. And you come in every week you weigh in and people are there to support you and encourage you and, and not judge you. If you have a step back, they say, okay, that's fine. Um, you're gonna be better next week. And that keeps you motivated. And that's really what I needed to be successful. And these people are like friends, but it's all right there. You can do this. Um, you just gotta get on a real plan. And, and there's so much misinformation out there. There's so much of this fad, this ridiculous stuff. that's just not real. And people know that. And instead of doing something positive, like coming to Dr. Frank, they do nothing at all, and they stay mired in this. Uh, somebody asked me, is this easy? No, it's not easy, it, it's, it is work. But I'll tell you what's really hard is living with diabetes, uh, living with heart disease, uh, living with the stigma of being obese, which there is a stigma, living with the ability not to do the things that you really wanna do, not check things off your bucket list, that's hard. By comparison, this has been very easy and I'm very committed to it. It's about changing a lifestyle. It's about the life you used to have, which is completely disconnected from the life that you have now. And I was pacing off of a, a, a person in front of me. From the very start of the race to the very end of the race, he was about 20 feet in front of me. And I tried to pass him a couple times, couldn't quite get the job done. And um, got over the finish line and we cooled down and I um, walked up to this person. I said, I, I gotta ask, how old are you? And he said, I'm 16. I said, far out, man, I'm 51. Um, now that's cool stuff. I mean, and it's not, a, it's, it's hard to imagine, it, you know, especially when you're overweight and you're, you're struggling, you can't imagine uh, being able to do these things, but it's all right there. You can do this. Everyone watching this video can have a new life. You can. All you got to do is wake up in the morning and say, okay, this is it. I'm committed to this. Imagine how much more energy you have at the end of the day, how much less stress your joints are bearing, um, your cardiovascular system is healthier. Um, all those things are possible in, in a relatively short period of time if you just commit yourself to it.